VE2FGJ radio question. How would an NFET antenna compare to a fan dipole antenna? Oh, fan dipole is so much better. <laughs> what kind of NFED? Oh. Well, I guess let's just say... Uh, K6 ARK NFED. Yeah. Which one? NFED random wire or NFED half wave? Because they're very different antennas. Yeah. Mm. So, so the, an NFED half wave is essentially a dipole fed at the end. And an NFED half wave in the exact same height and orientation as a dipole of the same length radiates basically the same as the dipole. Um, an NFED random wire, you get different radiation patterns and different efficiency, typically a little bit less efficiency uh, because it requires a tuner and you, you have a little bit of loss in your tuner, you have a little bit of loss in your transformer. Um, and uh, the NFED random wire is purposefully non-resonant um, and it needs to be about three eighths of a wavelength uh, to, to function on any given band. If you got a really uh, enthusiastic tuner in your radio or, or tuner to go with your radio, you might be able to tune up something shorter than that. Um, so on those, those shorter wires, when you're less than half a wavelength, uh, you're gonna have some efficiency losses and you're gonna radiate kind of similar to a dipole, but um, just not get as much power out. On the higher bands where you're more than a half a wavelength long in your, your wire length, particularly more than a full wavelength long, you're gonna get lobes of radiation kind of at a diagonal off of the wire. And as the wire gets longer, they're gonna narrow down kind of toward the, the wire endwise. Um, you can sometimes get a little bit of gain on those lobes if they happen to be pointing in the direction you want them to radiate. So, um, so an NFED random wire would be an option as a multiband antenna uh, with a tuner uh, as opposed to a, a fan dipole. The NFED half wave, if you have, say, a, an 80 meter or a 40 meter, they are oftentimes resonant on uh, all multiples uh, of, of wavelengths below that. So, um, for example, a 40 meter NFED half wave will typically be resonant on 20 meters, 15 meters, and 10 meters as well. Um, sometimes you have to do a little bit of fidgeting or, or uh, tweaking to get that to happen, um, but you can oftentimes get that without a tuner and they'll perform decently. So um, your, your fan dipole, generally speaking, is gonna be a little bit more efficient uh, and, and it'll take up a, a bit more space, but uh, probably be a little bit quieter antenna too because it is a balanced antenna as opposed to an end fed. What Adam said. Yeah, <laughs> and the, the shorter answer is the antenna you have is the best antenna. And if you don't have one, then just get, get one, one and <laughs> learn what you didn't learn the first time. And but then... It, it, you know, if, if you're trying to decide which one to build or set up at your, your place, um, the, the fan dipole will probably end up being a little bit better performer, but there's some significant drawbacks as far as complexity and space required to set it up. So, so those are all considerations you have to make. 